New at five, a father is in police custody tonight after a shooting that killed his three year old son in Chicago's South Deering neighborhood. CBS 2's Jeremy Ross is live at Chicago Police Headquarters where charges are expected in this case. Jeremy. Police are in the process of considering those charges. Detectives were in the neighborhood yesterday. The mood there, somber today. I don't like what I see. Officers hovered outside a home on Escanaba near 97th Sunday. Neighbors watch. It's devastating. Their stomachs in knots. As a parent, I wouldn't even know. I can't imagine it. Their chests heavy with grief. He was such a cute little boy. Just hit you in the heart? Oh, definitely. God forbid it happens to my kids. They're grown. When I would walk by, he would pet the dog. <coughs> so it's very tragic. You know, it's an innocent child. Three years old. Yeah, and I can't handle this. Mm -mm. Neighbor Mitzi Gaboyich and others learned three-year-old Micah Davis died on Sunday. Police say around 4.15 in the afternoon, the child was discovered in a home with one gunshot wound to the face. Adding DCFS has been called in to assist. That agency saying so far this year, there have been 17 reports of child deaths involving a firearm. South Deering neighbors describing the three-year-old carried out of the home with a blanket wrapped around his head. The family telling police they heard a gunshot while in another room and found their child with a gun. The young victim was taken to Trinity Hospital where he was pronounced dead. Oh, could you imagine? I can't imagine that. You can't have these things around little children. No parent should have to go through this. None. Mm -mm. Police are trying to figure out how that child got a hold of that gun. DCFS said they couldn't comment on any ongoing investigation. Charges could be filed at any point in time. Light outside of police headquarters, Jeremy Ross, CBS 2 News.